Part 3 of Battling Rocket Grunts and Scientists. Are you bored yet? This one I uh, accidentally found out what he has in advance. So I prepared accordingly. I'm going to try and get this thing beaten without any problems. It'll probably end up waking up and then using, like, World Destroyer, which is totally an attack. Like I said, World Destroyer. But whatever, at least I beat it. Yeah, I think he just called that thing weak. That, that, that was not weak. It's about as far from weak as you can get without going into, into legendary territory. Anyways, just moving on up. Random Jefferson's reference again, even though I don't know the lyrics to that song. Opening doors and whatnot. I'm not sure how long this is going to take, because I don't really remember how many uh, floors are left. I can't tell if that's a trainer or not. He has the same sprite as most of the trainers, but I j don't know. Let's see. He's not. Okay, so... No, I don't want to warp. Guess that's it for this floor, so let's just move on to new territory. Oh yeah, we got the Rocket Brothers. Never did understand the point of them. It's just these four random trainers throughout the tower who are brothers, but there's nothing really significant about them. I'm gonna go ahead and try out the bogey. Because I don't like using the highest level, but... Yeah, that, that was too awesome to not do. Alright, yeah, you're gonna have to take a rest for a while. Here we've got the conference room of no escape, apparently. Here, I'll, cl I'll clear out both exits, and then maybe they'll leave. Except they totally won't. I'm strangely prepared for this one. That was a critical, I think. I'm blasting through the text a bit too fast to tell, but I could have taken another one of those, but I guess I didn't have to. Sneasel, uh, that would be Brick Break Material. A lot of this really is very mindless. Just use a super effective attack, talk about it, and then move on. I mean, I don't know. It's Maybe it's not an, as annoying to watch, but recording it, I feel ridiculous just because it's so repetitive. Holy crap, that did nothing. Alright, now wa let's watch the stun spore hit, because when, there when there's no evasiveness drops, it always misses. Okay, never mind. I am now a monkey's uncle. There we go. Took two tries. Oh god. I don't really have anything else good against this. I mean, I could go for the Dream Eater, but I already paralyzed it, so that's out of the question. Hidden Power Ground could not work, because this is a poison type, and I don't want to send out Molly against it. So we're going for the weak side beams, apparently. Come on. Minimize, you're so annoying. And I don't know why it didn't keep the little quirk of keeping the sprite small, like it did in the older games. I, I liked that. It was just this tiny little, like, five-pixel asterisk sort of thingy. How am I a traitor? Yeah, th that, that's wonderful logic. Thank you. Why do I keep accidentally standing on those? Uh, let's see what else we got. Another stupid scientist dude. Caves, whatever. Or I should heal it first. I have those fresh waters just from accident, like trying to get lemonades, and I kept misclicking. Why does he have a Pichu? It doesn't really seem like a threatening thing to have. I don't know. Oh god, Parafusion. Yay! What was that, like a. 25% chance of hitting, and I made it anyway. Oh, God. Uh, let's just, yeah, go for the standard electric killer. Uh, 
Yeah, I think every Raichu in this game has Surf. Someone told me that it learns it at, like, level one. Uh, level one. So, you just have to use the move tutor to get it. I'm not sure if it can actually learn the HN. It would make sense if it could, but nothing makes sense in Pokemon, so I'm guessing it can't. Let's hope this thing doesn't sludge me to death. It's totally going to, so I don't know why I was hoping it wouldn't. Just false hope. And I'll check out the rest of this floor and then heal off screen, I guess. Don't know if there's anything. Yeah, just more items laying around. I haven't really been paying attention to what I've been getting. It's a lot of those stupid stat up things that I never use. So, yeah, I'll go heal off screen. Okay, onwards we go. After randomly looking at the trainer card and switching Molly up front, because she needs to experience the most. I keep thinking I'm hearing a Porygon Z cry, like in the background music. I've never noticed it before. Oh, God. Okay. Didn't do that much. But neither did that. So, I'm gonna have to go for the flamethrower here. Are we gonna be able to beat this thing even with that light screen up? Nope. Oh well. Come on. Hey! Hey! I hate Whirlwind. Ugh, you, you really have to do that? It's, it's a good strategy, but it's pissing me off. You're not supposed to be using good strategies. You're supposed to be terrible trainers. Is this the first Houndoom I've seen? I think I saw another one earlier, but that's just a weird sprite. Oh god, what is with this guy with this stupid shuffling... Ugh, I don't want to keep it in. I could possibly finish it off with the hidden power... Is that all you're gonna do? This one doesn't even appear to have toxic or anything. Oh, it has smog, which has a small chance of poisoning, I think. Let's see what this next one is. It's gonna be something with Roar. Whirlwind, no doubt. Scyther. Scyther might be able to learn Whirlwind. I don't think it can, though. And whatever, I'll just stay in. Okay, and last we've got Victory Bell, which I don't think can learn that. Let's just go for a Grasp. It's gonna have Sludge Bomb, isn't it? I always realize that when it's already too late. Oh, okay, it's gonna do that. And in this gen, it doesn't do anything to uh, the special, or the defense stats. Yeah, you go ahead and use Sweet Scent. It, it's not going to accomplish anything. You were better off with the randomly whirlwinding for no reason strategy. Don't swallow. Okay, good. And don't anybody take that in a dirty way, for God's sake. Swallow isn't a dirty thing. You do it all the time. Why can't I? Okay, um... There's a healing place somewhere. I f don't want to keep using items. But I don't remember where it is, so whatever, I'll just go for it. No, I didn't, because I've already fought like 90 other traitors by now. Let's just be thankful that he didn't evolve this thing, but then be disappointed in the fact, like, knowing that he's probably going to have, like, a Porygon 2 or something. You know he's going to. Nope, Manectric. But whatever. Unless it has Flamethrower, which it will. Because everything in this game has to have moves that it shouldn't have. But it didn't use it already, so... Are we reduced to this again? I thought we were beyond this. Oh, you're so pointless. 
Come on, just finish it off, because my segment's going to be ending soon, I think. I heard someone at the door. I, think, I hope they left. Okay. Um, I know I have, like, maybe 40 seconds at this point, something like that. Let's just, I already fought that guy. There's another trainer down there. Bulk up TM, probably not going to use that. I'll save that one for later. Um, yeah, I can't really go on at all. Oh well, I'll find that healing spot eventually, but for now I'm just going to heal off screen at the Pokemon Center and end in a stupid place once again. So, maybe next time will be the last one. I can certainly hope it will be.